What is going on, YouTube? Is you and the only the Mech Hector and here guys today, <coughs> bringing you episode number eight. If I do, if I'm not mistaken, of our Pokemon Blaze Glaze Nuzlocke. If you guys are hype, hit that like button down below, comment, all that fun stuff. You already know. Anyway, let's get a quick party recap for you guys. First up, we have Swell the Swellow, level 27, rocking that nice and powerful quick attack, aerial ace, return, and double team. Then we have Aaron the Lucario, the starter that you guys chose for us. Nice and quiet nature. Rockin' Karate Chop, Dig, Dark Pulse, and Bullet Punch. I was about to say, they're both the same nature. Um, no. But uh, next up, we have Percival the Brixian. Nice and lax nature. Rockin' Psybeam, Ember, Shockwave, and Grass Knot. And then finally, we have Minerva the Mischievous, level 19. Holding the EXP share to start getting caught up to the rest of the party. Rockin' Growl, Psywave, Confusion, and Astonish. Fun fact about Astonish, base 60 in this game. Never knew that. Alright, so I believe it's either this step, it's this step. <clears throat> I don't remember how this guy's voice went, but this is just gonna be my best guess at it. Hey, yo, Mega! <laughs> hey, remember me? We battled after you defeated that Pikachu. We've been training really hard, so we won't lose to you next time we met. Well, fuck! We were training, and I evolved! Aren't I magnificent? Ah, fuck my back. Ah, uh, uh, oh, back scratch. Ah, uh, it hurts. Did, did Quilava just talk? How is this possible? Wow, are you for real? A device that translates Pokemon speak? That's seriously badass. Has it made your Pokemon stronger, though? Let me see. In a battle! Dun. Dun, dun. Dun, 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 Level 27. Okay. That aerial ace is gonna not do as much as I want it to. I mean, it's doing over half. That's pretty easy. Curlia. Curlia can catch an aerial ace. Level 26. Magical leaf? That's resisted. Oh no. Attack. Uh. The crit. That's Swellow saying fuck you on that one. Quilladin? Well, that makes sense, because the other girl had a, uh, Frogadier. Wait, that means they're gonna have a Greninja. Do they normally- like, how did I get the one that neither of them had? That doesn't make sense to me. Man, you just keep bit being one step ahead of me. I better train a bit more before taking on Flo. See you around, Mega. Okay. And I believe- yeah, it's down here. Now we are here in, uh, what's the name of this town? Gemini Village, because there's a certain cave that needs to get fixed. Certain cave. And we have stacks to buy shit. Uh, we got those, got those. Do we have these? Mm, let's scoop up eight of these. Let's scoop up eleven of these. And I think we're good. Gemini Village. I do believe you can get fossils and stuff here, but, okay, so Geminite River is a new encounter area, so our encounter in Geminite River is... A Nidoran! You know what, I actually don't mind that. Nidoran's kinda dope. I kinda like Nidoran. I've been far away from my computer, so you guys probably haven't heard anything I've said up till now, but that's fine, because I'm a shitty content creator anyway. Huh? Okay. Computer, computer, work with me. Okay. Nidoran, you also work with me. There you go. Nidoran. Uh, I mean, I have a Moonstone, so... If I wanted to... By the way, I only have one nicknames ever for my Nidorans. Because, well, female Nidorans, because they become Nido Queens. And probably the most important queen of our time was Queen Latifi. Which is how it rolls. Let's actually check her out. Quirky Nature, Double Kick, Poison, Sting, Bite, and Help. That wouldn't be a bad addition to the team. Poison, Ground, two typings that I don't have. Uh, hmm. I mean, we have the Moonstone. You know, I'm going to look up what we're looking at in terms of a level up moveset in between episodes. That way I can decide if I want it. And Cleotis. 
Okay. Now let's go over here, I believe. No, we need to go into the house first. Aha. Uh -huh. I believe it's this guy? Hello? Can I help you with something, kid? Huh. A power spike coming from around here. I wonder if it has anything to do with the recent project we've been doing. You see, we've been using explosives to search deeper and faster into Mount Stratus. We've also been lighting the entire cave up system up, which is probably using a ton of power. If you don't mind, I need you to find the foreman in charge of the mining expedition. Tell him to dial it back, okay? Thank you. I've radioed to the miner blocking the entrance, so I'll let you pass. Be careful. Okay, so we're gonna go... Yeah, now he's moved out of the way. He's moved out of my way. A Dawnstone? Is this what Miss Magius needs? No. I need a Dusk Stone for that. Which I would love to get that sometimes hit. Rhyhorn. I don't have a water type. <laughs> uh, can you not stomp on me, Rhyhorn? That'd be great. Thank you. Swell grew to level 28. Rhyhorn. See, ground types are high key terrifying for my team. Simply because uh, there's a shit ton of ground types that are ground rock. So Swallow can't do anything and the rest of my team gets bodied by ground. Danger, live wires. <laughs> I need a swap. Why is Swallow still out front? I think I just need a swap altogether. And I get paralyzed. Karate chop. Boom, one shot. Next question. Bone Rush? No. Dig does more. Magnemite. Which, fun fact that I didn't ever realize, Magnemite was all was actually our only, or the Magnemite line, I should say, is the was the only electric steel types until 7th gen. Then we got the lovely little bastard known as Togedemaru. Look at Minerva growing, growing levels. Shout out to Minerva. Oh, not you, you fucking cock. 87 out of 88. Okay. Now, really quickly, let's... Uh, wait, can't we get an encounter in here? Survey says... <sighs> I don't like nice things. That bitch lived. <laughs> And this ain't uh, seventh gen leech life, so that's only base twenty. All right, Zubat, get in the ball. Now I only have one name for my Zubats, if they're male, of course, and that is Edward. And if I had space, I would write Colin, because once he's a crowbat, he literally is just like, look at me, look at me. I don't want to talk to you in case you're a trainer. And I... I could have had a timber! I mean, I have a fighting type, but still. Can I skip the trainer? Nope. All these trainers. Onyx. Fun fact, for those of you guys that did not know, uh, Onyx actually has a lower base attacks... Uh, wait, can I avoid the dig this way? Yo, look at the pro play. Um, Onyx actually has a lower attack stat than Oddish. I figure everybody knows that by this point, but you never know. There's Sableye's here. See, I hate Sableye. I hate Sableye with the Burning Passion of a Thousand Suns. And I also hate this with the Burning Passion. This hiker, he'll block your way. So you physically have to go back down that ladder and come up. Every single time. Because why not? Critical hit. Honestly, I don't know what I'm supposed to do for this next gym. Now thinking about it, because it's a water type gym. Nothing on my team can touch a water type. Hey, look, a Pokeball. And that's another thing that annoyed me about Glaze. I always would come up here and I'd get stuck because I was like, what do I do? What do I do? You're supposed to just go like that. Hey, yo, what in the. Who let a kid up here? I'm gonna tell you what. This ain't a playground. Da 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 da. Puh. Since when they care about that damn ever get me anywhere? I need money, and to get money, I need electricity. 
Now stand back, kid. Fire in the hole! Three, two, one. Huh? What's that? Avalanche! And he just pushes us out the way. And he's like, fuck you, bitch. Hope you go and die. And all these rocks fall in the way because of the avalanche. Well, damn, it sure looks like the avalanche stopped. Thank goodness it did, or someone could have gotten a very badly injured. You seem exhausted. Come and rest in the hiker's hut. I'm sorry about this. I was reckless and caused everyone to be in danger. I learned that lesson the hard way. It's not much, but take this. Strength. Which I believe in this game is a rock pit move. Uh, it will allow you to move boulders blocking your way. But you need the stem badge from Stormy City to use it if you outside of battle. Take care. The electricity should be back to normal now. Please tell Flo that everything, everyone here is sorry. Really quickly, I want to look. Fuck. No, it's still a normal type move. Is there anyone I want to teach it to? <sighs> See, in between... This isn't the original game. I forgot about this. Sir. Hey, yo. What's going on? Hey, yo. What is it? I'm, I'm a very busy man here. I managed to overhear the location of what you seek from the foreman in Gemini Town. Only the kid and the foreman know me. Hmm. Hey, yo. Give me a pastrami on 5th Avenue. Then take care of the kid. As for the foreman, fetch me my son, Henry. As you wish. Fuck, I know who that I that I gave him the wrong voice. They're supposed to both have Boston accents, because that was the Pikachu. Pikachu. So anyway. See, what I need to do is I need to look at my PC. Do I have anything to hurt a water type? <laughs> Man, I don't have anything to hurt a water type, guys. I have no idea what you're talking about. Uh I'll probably train up the Pikachu in between episodes just because I'll need it for the gym. But for right now, let's go ahead and head back up here. Repel. Right before I get into the grass. Really? Look, I even have a Thunderstone. It's fitting. An Ultra Ball. And then we got Doom, Doom, and then Doom. I can never remember people's voices. Oh my god. I'm a terrible person. I'm a terrible Let's Player. Power levels returning back to normal. Bucky though. Hey, for a kid, you did pretty damn good. He Wait, no, she had a deeper voice. Well, you found her. Yeah. Hey, for a kid, you did pretty damn good. Here, take this as my thanks. Obtain the HM06, which I believe is Rock Smash. I can go back to my gym now. I better get a challenge from you, ASAP, Mega. <sighs> I need to, like, literally what I'll need to start doing is, like, get a sticky note. And just write down how, like, everybody's voices went. Or something to remind me about their voice. But, unfortunately, I think this is where today's episode is going to have to end. Simply because I'm not ready to take on this gym. This gym, spoiler alert, has an ace of, I believe, 30 to 32 in this game. And as a team, it's very weak to water. Um... Yeah, a team that's weak to water, I can't just go in there all willy-nilly. So I'll probably train up Minerva and the Pikachu. Uh, might even try to think about a six-team member, I don't know. But everybody should be level 30, I think. Or I'm going to go look it up. Because if it's like 35 or some shit, then I'm going to get everybody higher. Because I don't want to struggle. Because I know this gym has some terrifying Pokemon. But with that, obviously, like I said, wrapping up today's episode here. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to hit that like button down below. Comment a comment if you so please. All that fun stuff. But with that, I'm going to get up out of here. This is the Mega Cactor. Signing out.